let's start off with our seniors. Megan Anderson. <laughs> Megan is accompanied by her parents, Rex and Rachel Anderson. Megan's been the marching band color guard for four years, and after graduation, she plans on attending college in Missouri. Her major is undecided, but is thinking possible of becoming a teacher. Megan also participates in National Honor Society, Winter Guard. She'd like to thank her mom, dad, Hannah, and Nathan for always supporting her. Color Guard being the best section. Abby, Ashley, and McKenna for being her piano partner. And her two dogs for being her biggest fans. Ladies and gentlemen, Megan Anderson. Up next, Drew Bashford. Drew is accompanied by his parents, Karen and Andy. Drew's been in the marching band for two years as baritone and two years as saxophone. And after graduation, he plans to attend college to pursue a degree in neurology. Drew is also a member of the National Honor Society, and he'd like to thank his parents, his teachers, and his section. Ladies and gentlemen, Drew Bashford. Yeah. Kylie Viner. Kylie is accompanied by her parents, Lynette and Mark Viner. Kylie's been in marching band for four years, and after graduation, she would like to attend Illinois State University or University of Missouri in Kansas City, but is undecided on her major and career at this time. Kylie also participates in Woodwind Choir, Basketball Band, National Honor Society, and the 2019-20 All-State Band. Kylie would like to thank all of her close friends who have helped her survive high school and her parents for always being there. Ladies and gentlemen, Kylie Viner. <laughs> Saibani Bandada. Saibani is accompanied by her parents, Vishnu and Chakra. Saibani has been in marching band for two years, and after graduation, she plans on going to a good university to major in neuroscience and anthropology to eventually become an oncologist. She's also a member of the national newspaper staff, National Honor Society, Future Business Leaders of America, Recycling Club, and National Honor Society. She'd like to thank her family for all the support and love, Mr. Stegman and Ms. Noble, for being amazing band directors. And Brenna and McKenna and Ashley yeah, yeah, yeah. and the whole flute okay, section so always yeah, making her smile. Ladies really and gentlemen, Saibani okay. Bandana. <laughs> Justin Christensen. <laughs> Justin is accompanied by his father, Eric. Oh, Justin's been in the marching band for four years as a saxophone player. Nope. After graduation, he plans to begin his education to become a doctor. Justin always partici also participates in National Honor Society, Basketball Band, Woodwind Choir, Science Club, and Knights of Excellence. Justin would like to thank Mr. Stegman, Mrs. Noble, the saxophone section, and the rest of the band family, and his actual family, Justin Christensen. Anthony Davidson. Anthony is accompanied by his mom, Amanda Johnson, and his father, Jeff Davidson. Justin's been in marching band for four years and is the section leader of the two. After graduation, he'll be attending Missouri State to pursue his Bachelor's of Music Education. Anthony would like to thank his girlfriend and his mom for being so supportive, Anthony Davidson. Brooke Dyson. Brooke is accompanied by her parents, Rachel and William Dyson. Brooke's been a clarinet player for three years and plans on graduating early. After graduation, she plans on attending Missouri S&T to major in computer science. She's also a member of the Win One Choir, Basketball Band, National Honor Society, and Mentors. Cook would like to thank her close friends and family for being there and always support her, and Mr. Segman for truly igniting her passion and love for music. Brooke Dyson. James Fairless. James is accompanied by his mom and dad, Jeff and Stephanie Fairless. James has been in marching band for four years, and after graduation, he plans to attend Stanford to study physics. James is also a member of the National Honor Society. He'd like to thank his family, his friends, and his brother, who has stuck by his side these past 17 years, James Fairless. Robert Fairless. Robert's accompanied by his parents, Jeff and Stephanie. Robert's been in marching band for four years and is section leader. After graduation, he plans on attending either Missouri State or Indiana University, and his major is undecided. Robert's also a member of the National Honor Society, Night Sound, Theater, plays volleyball for Francis Hall North. He'd like to thank his parents, Stig, Mrs. Noble, and Mrs. Onkin for helping him on his musical journey. 
his good friend Tyler for all the good times, and his brother James for being the best second half, Robert Perlis. Next up, Jack Ferry. Jack is accompanied by his parents, Lee and Janet Ferry. Jack has been in marching band for one year and jazz band for four years. And after graduation, he plans on attending Missouri College of Science and Technology to study engineering. Jack has also been a member of the Francis Hall North Boys swim team for three years and is captain. And is a member of the National Honor Society. Jack would like to thank his mom and dad, his grandfather, and his friends here at Francis Hall North. It's been a wild ride. Jack Ferry. Jonathan Finch. John is accompanied by his parents, Janice and Tyler. John's been in the color guard for four years, and after graduation, he plans on going to Mizzou for a degree in environmental science and plans to go for a job at NASA. John's also participates in Winter Guard, Publications, and Ecology Club. John would like to thank Mr. Stegman and all of the guard and band staff for always pushing him to be his best. Ladies and gentlemen, John Fitch. T.J. Gestering. T.J. is accompanied by his parents, Mandy and Bill, at Loftus. This is T.J.'s fourth year in marching band as Battery Brass Drum 3. After graduation, he plans on pursuing a college degree in computer science and cybersecurity. T.J. would like to thank his family for their love, encouragement, and support, especially when he's a bit off more than he can chew. He loves you guys so much. You are awesome. T.J. Gestering. Alex Goad. Alexis Goad. Alexis is accompanied by her mom, Brittany King, and her dad, Thomas Goad. Alexis has been in marching band for four years and plays the mellophone. After graduation, she plans to go to college and major in pre-anesthesiology. Alexis also participates in brass choir and winter guard. Alexis would like to thank her mom and dad for always being there when raising her to be the person she is today. She always wants to thank her section for helping her grow as a person, being the best section. Her band directors for guiding her to be a better musician. Our marching band and guard families for making her four years here fun and enjoyable. Ladies and gentlemen, Alexis Goes. <laughs> Next up, Brenna Hood. Brenna is accompanied by her parents, Mark and Emily Hood. She's been in the band for four years and played flute her freshman year, the piccolo her sophomore year, and drum major in her junior and senior years. After graduation, she plans to go to college to study dance with a minor in physical therapy. She plans to have cheer and dance, or excuse me, have a career in dance and then transition to be a physical therapist. Brenna has taken dance classes at the Performing Arts Center since she was six years old, learning a variety of style of dance. She's also grown up sailing with her family and now competes in, competes in races and volunteered as a counselor at Summer Youth Sailing Camp. Ladies and gentlemen, Brenna Hood. McKenna Jansing. McKenna is accompanied by her parents, Karen and Dave Jansen. McKenna has been in marching band for four years, and after graduation, she'd like to attend college in, to major in pharmaceutical science. McKenna is also a member of the Winter Guard, National Honor Society, and the Science Club. McKenna would like to thank her mom and dad for always pushing her to be her best, Ashley for being the best co-section leader she could ask for, Megan for being her piano partner, and the flute section for being the best section, McKenna Jansen. Colton Kehoe. Colton is accompanied by his parents, Kevin and Patty Kehoe. Colton has been in the front ensemble for four years, and after graduation, plans on attending college to pursue degrees in music and video game design. Colton is also a member of the National Honor Society. Colton would like to thank his mom and dad, family and friends, Mr. Stegman, the entire Night Pride marching band family for all their support over the past four years. Colton Kehoe. Parker Killen. Parker is accompanied by his parents, Kimberly and Joel. Parker's been in the marching band for four years. One year is alto sax, three years is tenor sax. After graduation, he plans on attending St. Charles Community College to pursue a degree in either psychology or mass communication. Parker also participates in jazz band, pep band, publications, cross country, and track and field. Parker would like to thank God, his parents, his brother Grant, his friends, the saxophone section, past and present, Mr. Stegeman. Ladies and gentlemen, Parker Killen. Charles Michael Kulai. Charles is accompanied by his parents, Stacy and Lindsay, and Charles Kulai, Sr. 
Charles plays bass guitar and has been in the band for four years. After graduation, he's going to finish his Army National Guard training next summer, then transfer to Nevada to attend the University of Nevada, Las Vegas, to pursue a career as a mechanical engineer. Charles also participates in basketball band, the A-plus program, and Boy Scouts. Charles would like to thank his parents, including bonus mom Sherry Tate, his grandparents, Mr. Stegeman, and all the kids in Brooklyn, the Ward family, and his battle buddies, ladies and gentlemen, Charles Coulage. Ashley Lowry. Ashley is accompanied by her mother and father, Jennifer and Joshua Sontag. Ashley has been in the band for four years, and after graduation, she plans on attending Florida Southern College and double major in biology and criminology to become a genetic counselor. Ashley participates in National Honor Society, FCCLA, Winter Guard. Ashley would like to thank her mom, Josh, Catherine, McKenna, Shivani, and Brenna and Megan for hitting her with a flag freshman year. Ladies and gentlemen, Ashley Lowry. Zoe Meyer. Zoe is accompanied by her mom, Angela, and her dad, Bill Meyer. This is Zoe's first year in marching band as a singer. After graduation, she plans to attend an out-of-state college to pursue an undergrad degree in classical vocal performance. Zoe has been also participated in Night Sound for three years, and this is her first year in jazz band. She would like to thank her family, teachers, friends, and boyfriends supporting her in all of her endeavors, Zoe Meyer. Dominic Murphy. Dominic is accompanied by his parents, Holly and Mike Murphy. Dominic has been the section leader for Battery for two years and has been part of the band for three and a half. After graduation, he plans on pursuing a career in either real estate or something with computers. Dominic would like to attend the SCC CAPS Global Business Entrepreneurship Strand. He'd like to thank his parents for supporting him and his girlfriend Shelby for making him who he is today, Dominic Murphy. <laughs> Shelby Murray. <laughs> Shelby is accompanied by her parents, Craig and Sheila Murray. She's been in color guard for four years, the last two years as a captain. And after graduation, she plans to attend Truman to become a behavioral scientist or detective. Shelby has also participated in Winter Guard for four years. She'd like to thank her mother and father for all they've done for her, her friends and family for having her back and supporting her, Dominic Murphy for making her strong, and Mr. Stegenham for good influence and in making four amazing shows that she got to participate in. Ladies and gentlemen, Shelby Murphy. Murray. <laughs> Up next, Catherine Pudman. Catherine is accompanied by her dad, William Pudman. Catherine's been in marching band for three years, and after graduation, she plans to study psychology, but is undecided on which college to attend. She'd also like to or she also participates in basketball band and woodwind choir. Catherine would like to thank her parents, her section, and anyone who else who has helped her on her musical journey. Catherine Budman. Tanner Rogers. Tanner's accompanied by his parents, Scott and Jennifer Rogers, and his grandpa. Tanner's been in the front ensemble for four years playing piano and marimba. After graduation, Tanner plans to attend St. Charles Community College. He's been a member of the symphonic band, jazz band, and brass choir. Tanner would like to thank his parents, his grandfather, Mr. Stegeman, and Matt Brown. Ladies and gentlemen, Tanner Rogers. Jay Scott. Jay is accompanied by his dad, Jamie Scott, and his mom, Lindsay Scott. Jay's been in the band for four years playing clarinet and has been co-clarinet section leader for one year. Jay is undecided on which college to attend after graduation, but plans to major in data science. He also participates in basketball band, woodwind choir, National Honor Society, and mentors. Jay would like to thank Mr. Stegeman, his fellow seniors, the kids from Brooklyn, his girlfriend Brooke, and his wonderful family, Jay Scott. Grace Barbera. Unfortunately, Grace is not able to attend this evening. Her parents are Lorna and Jack Barbera. Grace has been in color guard for four years and captain this year. And after graduation, she plans to attend college to major in sports science and become an uh, occupational therapist. She's also a member of National Honor Society, Winter Guard, and Science Club. And she'd like to thank her parents for always supporting her, her coaches for always pushing her to be her best, and last but definitely not least, her incredible teammates who never fail to put a smile on her face. Ladies and gentlemen, Grace Barbera. Nathan Bow. Nathan is accompanied by his mom, Regina Digger, and also his dad, 
Ty Bo. Nathan has been in marching band for three years, and after graduation, Nathan plans to attend college to major in computer science and his own business. Nathan also participates in jazz band. Nathan would like to thank his parents for supporting him in everything he does. Ladies and gentlemen, Nathan Bo. Carson Weinstock. Carson is accompanied by his parents, Leslie and Timothy. Carson's been in the band for four years and plays the trumpet. He's undecided on which college he'd like to attend after graduation, but would like to major in music. Carson would like to thank his mom, his dad, his late pets, pet rats, Zypher, Pepper, and Rory, and his dog, Gigi. Carson Weinstock. Tyler Windsor. Tyler is accompanied by his mom, Ken Windsor, and his dad, Philip Windsor. Tyler marched for one year of clarinet and two years as mellophone section leader. After graduation, Tyler plans on attending Missouri State to major in music education. He also participates in Night Sound and was a member of the 2020 All-State Band. Tyler would like to thank his amazing parents, Mr. Stegeman and the kids from Brooklyn, and everyone who supported his music, and of course, Robert Fairless. Ladies and gentlemen, Tyler Windsor. And last but not least, Holly Winkle. Unfortunately, Holly is not able to attend tonight. Her parents are Deborah and Clark Winkle. Holly's been a member of the Color Guard for four years, and after graduation, she plans to attend beauty school to become a hairdresser. Holly is also a member of the Winter Guard, Night Sound, and Bella Voices. Holly would like to thank her family for always supporting her, and everyone to help her become a better person, and her best friend Lily for always believing in her. Last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, Holly Winkle. Ladies and gentlemen, if I can get a big round of applause for the best band in all the land, it's your Night Pride Marching Band Seniors!